English have arrived and it doesn't look good. The men are speaking a fleeing. I think you should come now. Very well. William, you must go home now. This is no place for a child. Hurry now and run home to your mother. I can fight, Father. I know you can. I know you can. But I need you to look after your mother for me. Can you do that, son? Yes, Father. William! I love you, son. I'll be back. It's a fine day for a battle. Aye, it is, but some of the men don't think so. Men of Scotland, what's troubling you? The English have invaded our land. They have taken our fields and captured our homes and enslaved our people. They wish to take away the things that make us Scots. Uh, our wonderful games of pitching logs around uh, and the way our kilts uh, that which is most sacred to us that which by its very eating makes us Scots our haggis uh, <laughs> they're English or oh, too many they're too fittest for us we can never do it so what will you do then? Will you run? Yes, and we'll live. Aye, you may live. But many years from today, would you not look back and regret that you did not fight when you had the chance? That you did not stay and fight for your families, for your farms, and for your freedom? Men of Scotland, listen to me. Would you trade every day from now until that day, for one chance, for one chance to be free. The English, they do not care about the things that you hold dear and the things that you love. They do not come for peace. They come to make you slaves. What would you do without your kilts? What would you do without your haggis? Men of Scotland, Join me today and fight! <laughs> Let us today show the English that they may take our lives, but they'll never take our haggis! <laughs> My, you look mighty eager to die today, won't you say, Edward? My lord, as soon as they receive a taste of your force, those Scotsmen will run like the lily-livered, dress-wearing ninnies they are. Soon, Lord, you'll be finally finished of those wretched Scotsmen and their wretched haggis. Yes, quite right. Those filthy haggis-eating beasts. Prepare the men for attack. Prepare to attack! Ah! All right, men. This is it for Scotland!
Scotsman that's trying to lead this resistance we're in. I don't think so, boy. You're coming with me. for today. Let's camp here. A great victory today, my lord. Well, yes, it was, wasn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Edward. It won't be much longer before we defeat all the rest of that Scottish rabble. Soon all of Scotland will be mine. I cherish the day that Haggis and everything Scottish is no more. And what about the boy, my lord? Yes, yes, the boy. I think I shall make him my servant. It's quite fitting, don't you think, considering who his father is? He's getting away! Get him, Edward! Or I'll make you wish you were never born! You get him, Edward! You get him! I go! 